we thought it was sufficient for scientists to stand up to politicians and tell the truth. And we forgot actually that most of our understandings of the world and what's possible to change and not possible to change is mediated by art and culture and our stories that we tell ourselves of what's possible and what's desirable. The Creative Green Awards are particularly special because they celebrate organisations and individuals who are behind the scenes, who are stewarding profound cultural change. It's really important to have awards because you find that people are working really hard on sustainability and quite often it's not seen front of stage, it's always behind the scenes and making sure those people are rewarded and recognised for what they're doing is so important. For the rest of the green team back at the Onassis, just being nominated was a motivation you know, to really try harder. To be recognised in amongst all these peers with an award like that is a huge honour. The award goes to Al the Almeida Theatre. The winner is Studio Oliver Elias. The best creative group is Tyne and Weir Archive and Museum. We are celebrating those organisations who've really gone above and beyond. And celebrating our successes together is uh, an enormous opportunity to connect and learn and be joyous. We neglected our deep understandings, whether they were expressed in stories that we hear, in the poems that we read, in the history that we come to understand as it's reflected back to us. So your role in enabling the great transformation to happen is absolutely vital. We are going to continue. There's so much more that needs to be done by everybody, ourselves included. It's not like an award and then it's done. It's, it's, you know, it's just a recognition of how far we've got so far. There's an awful long way to go yet. Yeah.